Uh, hey, Virginia traffic! We're gonna talk and stuff. YouTube! What's <laughs> good, YouTube? I got Whitey with me. This has been my girl since A school. Got Belzilla. Belza in the back seat. Are oh, you gonna act anti social with the camera? <laughs> We don't have like a car discussion, bro. Since we're in traffic, turn the camera around. Look at, bro. I hate I Virginia. I don't know. I think you just flipped. You gotta turn the whole phone off. Turn the whole. Bro, this is traffic in Virginia, bro. Turn it around, bro. Turn it, please turn it around. Now like, put it back out of the window, bro. Man, bro. <laughs> and we've been stuck in the same spot for like 20, 30 minutes, bro. For real. I ain't gonna say 20. I'm gonna say about 15, 20. This has been a fucking fat minute. Yeah, no. so I've been like, sorry I haven't been posting. It's been like two weeks. I know y'all was like, when is this gonna go post? So look, I'ma post today. What we gonna talk about? What y'all wanna talk about? Why not to come to fucking Virginia, <laughs> bro? I hate Virginia traffic, bro. Cause it's like the two lanes go like under the bridge, and if it's like an accident, I think it's an accident up there. Like this, heat. like hear that bell? So there's an accident, <laughs> and we gotta work out. I gotta do something for Belza. I ain't gonna say what it is because I don't want them to know that yet. I gotta do something for Belza. We gotta go to Walmart for like to find some of the groceries. And we gotta cook groceries, bro. And it's like. Cook groceries. What? Like cook food, I mean. You know what I mean? <laughs> cook groceries. Yeah. Um, I'm trying to find like a good discussion we can have. Shouldn't have that, shouldn't have that been like a thing we figured out before doing all this? I know, but this will make it fun. Let's talk about the first night in boot camp. Like, from when you left from MILPS all the way until when you made it to your bed. Like you remember cool. that? Did you have the room? But did you have the room? I didn't. Yeah. I have the room too. But I'm saying, but that was still like a part of boot camp, like that first night getting yeah. there. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, it was like that experience. You get what I'm saying? Yes, sir. The only difference is, like, we got, like, the when we was all standing in the middle of the P-Way or whatever, mm -hmm. and then that's when we had the room. Dude, there was, like, maybe two, I think there was only fucking two girls when I was there, and the rest were all fucking dudes. That's it. That Bro, it. I will never forget this night. Like, okay, so I remember going to Chicago or whatever, right? And we get to Chicago, and I ain't got no seatbelt on. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta be setting a good example and stuff. So I remember when <clears throat> got off the uh, the plane for Chicago and like we was like, I was like okay big I ain't gonna be able to eat nothing good for too much. I was like I'm finna go to McDonald's right because we still had like the little ticket that they give you you eat for free. Uh -huh. I was like I'm finna go to McDonald's because this finna be my last meal. So I got to McDonald's. And I was like, all right. So we had to sit down you in the had area. To eat before you got there, dude. Everything when I got there was fucking closed. For real, I bro. I got anything. there like at six o'clock. I got there like at six, and I stayed there till like twelve o'clock. No. Imagine sitting, and you can talk. So they was like, when you go down there or whatever, bro, they're gonna say you, you gonna sit down and you can eat what's over here. And then the bag got like little peanut butter jelly sandwiches yeah. and stuff like that. And that was like, you can't say nothing. I don't want to hear no talking. Like, ours, ours was peanut butter and chocolate. Yeah, that shit was nasty. Peanut butter and chocolate. I just yeah. had peanut the, butter and the jelly. The fucking Uncrustable thingies, right? Yeah, I had the Uncrustable thingy. Mine was peanut butter and fucking chocolate, dude. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> it was. It was the fucking grossest thing so, ever. So, um, I remember sitting down there was like, you can't do no talking this and that. So, we waiting on the bus. They said the bus is going to get there like at 8 o'clock. 8 o'clock rolled around. Oh, well, the bus is going to be a little late. Nine o'clock rolled around. The bus still gonna be a little late. We went on the bus. Ten o'clock rolled around. The bus ain't gonna be there. bro. So the bus got there at twelve o'clock. This like way get really huh? I'm like two a.m. Bro, my bus got there at twelve, bro. I remember this like it was yesterday. I remember getting on that bus, bro. And on the bus, we all sitting down. It's dark, like it's cold on the bus. And you remember, like the little video was playing on uh -huh. the TV screen. Really you have like, joined the America's best navy. Uh, our core attributes in the first general order, and it goes slow, like, and then it's like, the, it was like the more it talk, it was like, 
the energy for boot camp was just like pumping up because it was like, man, I don't know what I got myself into. So then at the end, I seen the gate. It said something. What that gate say? It's, it says something about the United States Navy boot camp or something. I seen the sign. I was like, oh, snap. Here it go. Like, this what I signed up for. What? Bro, <laughs> I remember I I hear I just seen a man walking outside and I hear the man open the door. All I heard is get off the bus. Get, get the, the fuck off the bus. bus. I was like, oh my god, what I signed up for. So I'm in the middle and I remember <laughs> hurry up, hurry up. So I got my bag. I remember why I swear to God I was running right. And so as I'm running. <laughs> I just remember my leg going. Whoom. I had I hit that quarter so hard trying to get in that building. Why? I swear to God. And my boot bag, so I had like this little green Nike boot bag. My boot bag in the back, just bouncing like that while I'm ready. I'm like, man. So we get there, we all lined up, bro. It was this girl. She was beside me, right? She's shaking like I can feel like she was like shorter than me. I can feel her whole body shaking. <laughs> and I started saying, baby, it's gonna be okay, but I ain't wanna tell her that. So I was a little nervous too. Then after that, they had to do weigh-ins. Oh. I seen like one of the petty officers laughing or whatever. Like he was fussing at one dude, he started laughing. He was like, get out of my face. And the dude turned around and he immediately started laughing. I was like, okay, y'all play too much. <laughs> like when, when I see him laughing at that point, I was like, okay, I ain't even no need to be nervous no more. Cause at that point they know what they are doing. Oh yeah, of course. Then after that, what happened? Oh, the phone call. So I made my phone call. My mama ain't even answer the phone, bro. <laughs> I called my mama. Everybody got their car, read their car. So I called my mama. No answer. So I'm like, oh, she ain't gonna answer the phone. It was about 12 o'clock at night. Tell me why. The man's like, who didn't get to talk to their parents? Here go me. I didn't see. <laughs> he gonna say, hold on tight. Write his name down. I said, you know what? I'm okay. Don't worry about it. I don't wanna know. So I ain't get to call my mom on the first night. What else happened? Bro, and then after that, the sea bags, and then they usher your ass on that fucking bus. Bro, I hated packing the seat. Like, hold a pen in your right hand. Write this down. Hold this in your. I said your right hand, recruit. <laughs> what is your right from your man, bro? This man stood up on the table, hollering up at this, hollering at this guy, bro. Like, fucking hell. And then we had to like, I ain't gonna say get naked, but we had to like take our clothes. He was like, I hope you're not embarrassed because y'all finna change right next to each other and I'm not gonna get y'all a chance to look at anybody. <laughs> bro, hurry up put the pants on. And he was scrambling and so it took you longer because your hair's like trembling and it, you trying to go fast. Bro, and it and was like at one point I was looking for a pen. I couldn't even find a pen, bro. I was so mad, bro. Like I was shaking. I was like, yeah. I thought you went, went back to kindergarten with that shit because you were was and writing with such shit. And that was about my exciting night. What about y'all? How y'all night went? What was the most what was the most memor memorable part of boot camp that night? Your first night getting off that bus. What was the most memor memorable part? I fucking cried. You did? I cried. <laughs> <laughs> What'd you cry for? Because she was yelling at me and it was only the two of us. And so they were like they oh, the two girls. Oh, so they had to make sure y'all was known that y'all had to get fussed What she said, was, what? She was like, you know what? Turn your ass around, pull your fucking mask down, and breathe. <laughs> I remember Quavo was saying something about some girl had threw up all over the yeah. uh, P-Way, bro. And it was like, she didn't just burn. Like, she was just constantly <laughs> burn, burn, burn. Like, she was constantly throwing up. And she had to mop. They made her mop it, right? And they said after they made her mop it, she was still throwing up, bro. Oh, ain't no, no way. It ain't enough nervousness in the world, bro. Oh, it ain't. Lord. At the end, I feel like this. Oh, hold on. I'm going too fast. Bills, you got anything memorable to say about your boot camp night? I had to carry a woman. For real? Yeah. You had to carry a what? I was the second person off the bus. Uh-huh. And they were yelling at us, like, 
you know, to watch our steps so we didn't fall off the bus. Right. Well, one chick, she didn't listen. She just started fucking running. <laughs> and so, like, she fell off the bus. I just picked her up and started, I just kept going. Did they flip the shoe free go? No, they didn't say shit. But hey, but no, but then you're helping the sailor out. You gotta help yeah, some, you gotta help a recruit out. That's what you had to do. Yeah, we had kids getting cussed out when we had to get the uniform issue and all that shit. Yeah, that and was basically things, though. Shit. Kids were getting cussed out. It was funny as fuck. Yeah, that was about it. I seen one guy, he was, uh, I can't remember the motherfucker's name, but he threw away everything that he brought. Yeah, I, it was, a, yeah, it was a dude. He threw away the, uh, everything he got, too. I think this guy, I don't know, was it Garcia? I think Garcia threw away everything he had. I hope you watched this video. But yeah, I think Garcia threw away everything he had. I don't know, I can't remember. I kept on my shit. I did too. I Even though, it, bro, it was the putting the phone up. It was the putting the phone up that had took me away. Like, when they said put that phone up, bro, I was hurt. Yo. When oh, I got yeah. my phone back, it still had like 50% charge. No, I remember my, my the night of boot camp, I had like 3% on my phone. After I got out of boot camp, which was two and a half months later, I was like, I had like 2% left. What the fuck? Yeah, it was crazy. It was Damn. Crazy. Um, I thought but, mine did good. Yeah, mine did very good. So what advice would you give people for boot camp? How about that? Advice. What advice would you give? Don't be too fucking nervous. That's, yeah, like, don't, don't be nervous. Like, they they expect people to mess up. Like, yeah, you're expected to mess up. You're expected to do something wrong. Just don't constantly keep doing it wrong and pay attention. Like, that's another thing. Yeah. Pay attention to what you're doing. Like, just, and don't be nervous. Like, I, I, like, I understand when you're doing it, like, you want to be able to talk to people right. and, like, make sure that you're feeling okay. Right. Like, just, you know, having the social. Right. But if you fucking pay attention and you don't stamp your shit wrong and, like, petty officers beat your ass for Bro, it, you know, like, then... Those beams Then you're gonna be a okay dude, because if you sit there, like, even through all the fucking boring-ass lectures, mm -hmm. like, just wait until you get back to that compartment when y'all have a fucking minute to fuck off. No, it'd be, like, at night. It, it, do y'all remember like this every night? Like for the first week and a half, they have like the speech at night. Hey, you guys, <laughs> we need to come together. And all that. Wait, hey, wait, wait. What do you mean first week and a half? That was the entire fucking yeah, two it was months. The whole time for us. Two for real? Months, bro. Not for us, bro. It was like after that first, like I ain't gonna say two weeks. I'm gonna say about that first month. All right, bro, go to bed. We tired. Yeah. Like we don't want to hear. Fuck out my face. That was straight, bro. Um, but yeah, um, I think I'll come up with another video. I'm trying to do another. No, what? Shine the camera on, uh, Belsa. So, um, I think this guy is like one of the best boot shiners in the Navy. And don't show him now. Don't show him now. That's unset, bro. Like, <laughs> that is very unset. But no, like, so we're gonna do a video where, like, we're gonna show y'all how to shine your boot. Leave if room. and when you ever fucking shine your boots. Don't say that. Now I'm going to cut that part out. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to do a, uh, I think my next video, I'm going to show y'all like how to shine y'all boots correctly or whatever. My guy, can, he can shine boots. Like, I can't lie. Um, But yeah, that's about it, man. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Um, Comment anything, you know, any questions y'all got, come and ask me. I'm going to reply to them the quick, as fast as I could. And that's about it, man. Anything you want to say? Fuck no. <laughs> Bells. Alright, peace people.